What's up, everybody? How you doing? This is Max Boogie from Wall Street. I'm over here running with Daniel Taylor in the week four game against the Baltimore Ravens. And I actually actually out and bought uh, some some stuff. I actually bought the fight for yards trait. And I haven't bought anything else before that. I've just been playing regular playing with the stats that they gave me at the beginning of the season. And I've been doing good, you know what I'm saying? I've been doing well, but I bought it. Cause I had a lot of XP left over. Cause I only been I haven't been doing anything with it. I haven't even been playing the game prep. I haven't even been doing that. Cause the one for the running back is like you run, use the acceleration burst, and try to score. A and I wasn't really good at that. You know what I'm saying? I don't, I don't know if it was just me or the blocking or for the receiver it was terrible. But um, I only got into the end zone like six times. You know what I'm saying? I think I passed still, but. Still, it was boring. I didn't feel like doing it. So I just didn't do it all along. So I don't do it for Quincy Blunt either. I might start though, because Quincy Blunt, he doesn't get as much XP as Daniel Taylor does after the game is over. So I might have to do it for Qu just to get him better. But we do end up scoring with that dive, dolphin dive over the line, getting into the touchdown. And you know what I'm saying? Daniel Taylor does that a lot. He did a lot in Miami back when he was on the Dolphins. And now he bringing it over to the Panthers. So whenever he's in that, that two-yard range, you know he's going to try to dob over the whole line. Hopefully he can get it again in this game. So we're going to see what this fight for yards really does, man. If you've watched the other Daniel Taylor videos, I want you to compare it. Compare the amount of broken tackles in those videos versus the amount of broken tackles in these videos. And we get the screen and we go all the way upfield. And I, I think... I, I outran the D-liner right there, but I think the first tackle with uh, the fight for yards trait is always broken. We get, we blocking nice, too. We blocking nice for Cam Newton. This this is not imposter Cam no more. For some reason, he decided to, to come back. He, he, he took his way in stunt double, and he decided to come back and play for the Panthers. And, you know, we be out here blocking for him now. But um, I think it, for the, the fight for yards trait, I should have checked the, uh, the elusiveness, my elusiveness rating as well, but should have checked it because it seems like I break every first tackle no matter what move that I do. If I do a spin move, a stiff arm, the, just trying to run them over, I seem to, I seem to break the, every tackle, you know what I'm saying? Just the first one. The second one might not be be, break it, be uh, broke, but I might still be like fighting for yards as like the trait says. So I wonder if it's helping me with breaking tackles and... Maybe it is, you know what I'm saying? I'm not really sure. I, I looked at the other videos. I was breaking tackles there, but I wasn't doing it as much. And right before halftime, man, we over here going for it on fourth down. What do you know? Cam Newton scores on the pass play, deep bomb downfield. And we, we ended up scoring, man. It was real nice to get this touchdown right before halftime. They haven't scored yet in the game. So, you know, Luke Keekley and the rest of the defense. They really, they really on lock up right now. But we get the ball back after halftime. It is already 20 to zero. Does not look good for the Ravens. And we, you know we gonna keep on running the ball. Somebody asked me about how many carries did, did Daniel Taylor get. You know what I'm saying? He gets a good amount because he runs the offense. There is no offensive coordinator. There's just Daniel Taylor and he calls the plays. You know what I'm saying? That's how you, that's how you gotta do it if you like the running back. You're going to be on your, you trying to get yours, you know what I'm saying? He, he got to call the plays for himself. And he does like to run the ball a lot. So he gets a good about 30, 30 carries a game when we get the touchdown. And we actually ran over, we broke one tackle at like the two-yard line. We got pushed into the touchdown with the second one. So I guess he's fighting for those yards that got into the touchdown. And his elusiveness or his trucking broke the first tackle. So I'm not really sure about how the fight for yards trait really works, but like it's really, I'm saying I'm running good right now. The block is actually good from the O-line. I guess they get XP still as well, even though you're not controlling them. You know what I'm saying? Maybe they getting they blocking up. Maybe they actually doing the game prep because I know I'm not. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> I just can't, can't get into it, man. I, I don't know about it, but I did start playing ultimate team. My team is real tough. I've, I've been watching a couple tip videos. I think I watched some um, Ryan 915 or something like that. He, it was something his something Monday. Mutt, Mutt, uh, I don't know. It was something Monday. I watched it. Had some nice tips in it, man. I, I got my team like a 78 overall, and I'm sick. Because he, what he said to do wasn't really 
I did it the opposite way. I started with like defense first when he started to do offense. And I got two defensive styles up and I couldn't get them above 90, so I couldn't even play the last game. But anyway, we don't need to talk about that. But man, this game is basically over. 37 to 0. We is kicking on the Baltimore Ravens. I don't know who's uh, who else is on their defense that was like really, really tough. Because they lost Ray Lewis and Ed Reed, and I think that was really like their two star defensive players. They still have Terrell Suggs, and he's pretty old right now. We get another touchdown scoring on fourth. Didn't even need it. We could have just kicked the field goal, but Daniel Taylor says forget it. You know what I'm saying? We, we want to win. We want to win bad. You know what I'm saying? So, this video is coming to an end right after this touchdown. Always remember, in the street we trust, I'm out.